guy, you have to help me, Bana. My mama is gonna kill me. Let's go, let's go! You guy! You guy, my guy. Yeah, I'm your guy. My guy, my girl. You guy, my guy. What is it? What is it? You guy, my guy. You guy, my guy. Hey, hey, what up? What's up? George Kago in the building. Some BTS stories about what you have just seen. Just Kidogo to Kionja. If you've not watched the film, if you've not watched Ahmad Daham in Kenya with his Lexus, 1200 horsepower Lexus. Bro, watch the film. Link in description. You know what to do. Click up in there. Red Bull Motorsports. Thank you so much. And here's the story. So most people have seen in the comment section are like, hey, even this one guy like, bro, Buddha Kiongos, ulipata ajoi kasi buwana. Hey, let me tell you, it was just a quiet, normal day. In August, around August, September 2022, and I receive a call. I don't know who the number is. I pick it up and they're like, they tell me that they're from Quite Bright Films, QBF Production House. I'm going to big things. Yo, Production House, Buddha Kikpigia. Una, amuka kutoka kitu, una piga salute. Una fanya evo, bro. So they call me and they tell me, Hey, boss, we have a client and they've requested for you, personally for you. And they're insisting that they want you. Hey, who is client mgani? Ni client mgani uyo? So they tell me, eh, it's Red Bull. And Red Bull want you specifically. They have a very good concept that they believe you will work perfectly with this concept. Uko game? Kawambia sasa niko game lakini ni lazima nijue brief kidogo. Waka niambia brief hapa kule. Una kwa majuu juu hawezi ingia ndani ndani sana. Siko ndani ya kazi. Nikawambia sawa niko ndani. Haya jamaa akisema wewe fanya hivi eh. Mimi sitaki mambo mambo wetu mie how much you will cost this thing. Leo by leo jioni ilikuwa kitu kama 2 pm 3 pm ame jamaa amenipigia. Mimi nikatuma without any issues without any questions. Ini kazi imejipa. Mimi nilifanya nini? George Kagwe akatuma cost zake muru wa kabisa ini Red Bull International tukangoja. One week. Two weeks. After two weeks, mimi ni kondani ya mkutano, naona simu inapiga, trukola inaniambia lady called Ruby. It's calling you, brother. Sijui Ruby ni nani? Nika Rudy kupigia Ruby. Hello, how are you? Uh, my name is George Kagwe. How can I be of assistance? Oh, George, hi. My name is Ruby. I am calling you from Red Bull. Uh, we are really excited that you want to work with us. Now, I really want us to work with you directly. Okay. okay. Uh-huh. Yeah, we saw the cost that you sent, which is fine. Now, we want to meet you so that we can tell you what the concept is, so that we can see how this will be able to work well. We even want your ideas to be put in. We want to see how you love our ideas, what you can what you can basically embellish in our ideas or improve. Uh, so, how do you want us to do this? Virtual meeting? No, 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 no. Let's meet physically. We even want to gift you some of our, our gifts, so no problem. So, how about we meet for brunch? Hey, brunch. Nani, Dani, with my wife in tow. Yeye ndio el manager. Twende mkutano. Tukaenda mkutano, tukafanya mkutano. Tukaongea two and a half hours, my brothers and sisters. So, pale tu tunongea maneno more. Just for people to learn, you have to go sit down with the client. Wengo na itashmuzi mimi, ita relationship. You have to start a good relationship. You have to know them. You have to know the things that they want to accomplish. You have to know the things that they really are passionate about. Why they chose you. Know even the person personally. To a personal level. People work with people. Now what wanna work now to your relationship? Are you likable? People will not remember what you said or what you did, but they will remember how you made them feel. Take that to the bank. Anyway, so to fanyam kutano, to set date, kila kitu inadi, mimi excitos. Production time in Mesetiwa ita kwa October Ray. Pale around a 19th, 20th. Wakanyambia, we need three days from you, brother. No problem. What's the first day? Reki. Yeah, so we are here in town, CBD. Today is uh, day one. Today is a recce day. Something international. Boy is going international, man. Who knew? Mama, look, I made it. So we are at KCC meeting up here. Uh, today is recce day. Full day recce day. Let's go. Recce to Kaingia Pale in a me sikulala. I did not sleep. I did not sleep. Oh, okay. Kukula nili kula. Lakini kulala, I did not sleep. It was exciting. It was fantastic that we were going to do this great production. And from what I heard, it was going to be amazing showcasing this country. It's positive content. Content that showcases who we are as a country, as a people of Kenya, of this republic that we are born in and we love. Ah, Reki ilikuwa shambamba. Met the whole team. Got to meet Ahmad Daham. 
All right. So, Ricky going well. Ricky going well with wifey. So we've met uh, Ahmad Daham, we've met directors, so we've done Reki for Town, now we're headed to the next stop. Got to meet um, Production House QBF Local, International Case Productions, Salim and his team. Uh, got to meet the rest of the Red Bull team. Uh, got to meet some of the production crew, like the guys who are flying the drones. So we had FPV drones. Hey, Buddha, kuna my youngster pale, ningo, hey, he's a shot zote, to Anyway. So we got to meet the whole team and the whole thing, what a recce is, for anyone who doesn't know what a recce is, a recce is basically a reconnaissance visit. It's, it's the first time everybody who's involved goes around to all the sets, all the locations, so that we can see how things will come to fruition, how they will be able to be brought to life, from paper to life. So that's what we were doing. Recce was shambamba. We went to all the locations. So, still doing the recce, we're at the Westland. Yeah. Uh, toll, whatever you call it. Toll booth. Toll booth. What's up? Are you ready? You guy, my guy. Yeah, I'm your guy. My guy, my girl. You guy, my guy. What is it? What is it? You guy, my guy. You guy, my guy. Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, another location, another recce. This is Red Hill Roundabout. Now, my shoe, Uko. <laughs> location number this is a fifth location so we are deep in Lemuru Kiambu County yeah, in Gidiga area So that's Daham at the distance, just checking out the road. Of course, also that's vlogging, checking out how this space is. We have Ruby checking into frame from Red Bull, Salim, director, and that's Amber, QBF. We're just checking out the zone, checking out uh, we're right here next to Suswa. Actually, we're in the Suswa area. Yeah finished that whole thing at uh, at the Ngong Hills Palette, Mimi na Mama, Pale Ile View to Kangalia to Kaisoki in a sunset Mbaya Sana. And my night did not uh, my evening did not end there, so we had to go and check out the car and see if I'll fit if George Cowboy, this chubby, chunky, yummy looking kind of guy, will be able to fit in that moti. So see see how wow 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 There's the gadgets, guys. Came at night time to scoop this gadget. What wang, my guys? Paka kwenye katana iko, my first time to meet 
the lovely katana Lexus. Buddha, hiyo gari ni noma. Lexus RCF Buddha. Waacha niwaambie hiyo kitu hapana machezo. Hapana machezo. 1200 horsepower. <laughs> Alafu pia weight imeshiviwa off pale iko 1250 so it's made out of carbon fiber so utaona ma windows ama kitu kama hiyo so it has to be light just for the it to be able to do the job right it has to be light to do the job right you understand what i'm saying so it's a Lexus RCF and uh, the, the the basically the engine is also an NMK performance 3.0 2JZ VBTI engine Hey, hiyo kitu iko kitted out. Pale kuna pale ndani pia kuna Nitrous Express 200 horsepower kit. Eh? Mimi nakwambia ile gari imekitiwa out huwesjua huwesjua and a lot of things for cooling, a lot of electronics, drive terrain, a lot of steering and suspension and brakes as well that is need, needed and needed. Uh, wheels and tires as well uh, hey, and drifting tires pale toyo tires pale wameweza ku sponsor Ahmada pale mataya tulikuwa tunatumia bro zilikuwa kwa flatbed mbili mataya mpaka juu ai so it was such a great great time for me to be able to meet Katana na tukaingia pale ndani tukafit kiti seat belts zikaweza kuwekwa na tulikuwa inside in our the in our in in our the area So we were ready. Mimi nikaambia wewe enda lala kesho ni kas kas. Hey, mimi siku lala bro. Hey, utalala aje ukijua. Hey, unalala tu nimesikia sauti ile gari. Hey. So the next day Mongen asubui the morals to come Kangware tulikuwa pale set tulikuwa tunafaa kuwa pale set by 6 o'clock in the morning first set tuligonga ni pale kwa smoky pasua pale kwa hile bypass ya red hill that's where we were tukaingia pale sikuweza kula nilikula labda sauce mbili na maji hiyo ingine nikagoja sasa action Ready? Good man. Good good sleep. Six hours, not bad. That's enough. Yeah. You know when you're sleeping in the car. <laughs> Imagine you get so bored like what? <laughs> Slap. Oh, Just time. Today is all good. Today But you've eaten good. breakfast, you're good. No, no, I don't eat now. Yeah, later. For later. <laughs> Did you eat? Just tea. Tea. Maybe one sausage. One sausage? Yeah. You're going to have another one now. No, no, no. no. I have uh, <laughs> <laughs> just just to be safe <laughs> <laughs> just to be on the same side <laughs> yeah, Charlie Did you use the bathroom uh, right now I'm waiting then I'll use it <laughs> <laughs> just before I go but in the morning I cleared my stuff everything yeah so just in case pale tunangalia set tunangalia what is happening they were doing different things for for the car for example they had to lift my side because of my weight some people asking also in the comment sections like in the in the main film um, how did this guy fit in there how were they able to drift gari iko na power tu wangu usiangalia gari gari inaweza beba kama mnyinyi mnabeba ngombe ndani ya pro box sisi sembuse sisi all changed in my gear helmet fitted and it's fine a few adjustments being made to the car because of my weight so they are raising my side just for a little bit um, yeah just to balance the car out so let me show you guys Right. 
So it was very important for us to be able to just get it right because um, Red Bull, Ahmad Daham are big on safety. So they are big on safety and safety of not just the driver, but of me as the passenger and also anybody else who's on the road as well. So it was very important for us to be able to do all that. So they were doing a few adjustments. Uh, they were also doing some 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 setting up as a, as you can see the crew there on a kamakamenje pale magopro kulkona magopro pale ndani. So that's the setup. Steering is off. It will be put in. We have some GoPros there and at the back. We have sound right there at the back. So we've just done a kind of like a dry run rehearsal. Kai is powerful. Really powerful. Bruh. Um, and uh, that was not even 1200 horsepower that we felt so it was just uh, so so far ready ready it's the ham is here and it's time let's go and we capture everything we'll copy on our audio equipment just to capture the sound inside although the car is very loud first day first scene was superb and for me the star of that space apart from Ahmad Daham himself who's a freak of nature was the guy who was playing the part of the smoky pursuer vendor Wo jamaa akugwaya. Ai! Mimi ngekwa mimi by the first time. You know it's just it's not just the car coming, it's also the sound, the smoke, it's it's everything. So hiyo ndio ilikuwa the first scene. <laughs> From there tukatoka hapo tukaenda Limuru. Boda Limuru. Hey! Limuru. So not much traffic traffic is clear roads are clear and it's a perfect day no you know not, not much cloud cover it's a great sunny day for lighting kila kitu iko sawa open roads this is where we will get to see the performance of katana Habibi! So the twists and turns, we did a few takes. I was having a blast. Hey, but I had to, so I always had to have in mind that I'm acting. For me, this is a dream come true. It's a dream come true to be working on such a project in regards to cars, in regards to motorsport, in regards to something that I've always loved from when I was young. This being the first kind of project, Maze, Palendani na Igari. I'm the long Yani co driver seat. I'm the guy who sat there for the longest. For two days straight. So good. Yeah. Yeah. So we started from up there. It was good. Cool. The car has more power now. That's yeah. what even Daham said. Okay. So it was just good. My adrenaline, adrenaline is back, back up. Red Bull in me. Awesome. And so it's fantastic just to see it happen. Yeah. So I did some also good ones just down there. Mm-hmm. So it was fantastic. Awesome. Off to the next location. For me, the best part for Limuru was this long stretch. This 
this long stretch started down the hill just before the first bend and we came through the first bend up the hill then tunakuja chini tukichapa drifting then akakata tena hivi Buddha, I believe we were between 140 and 180 on that corner. And we were moving, moving. So just to explain to you guys, we are strapped in. And yes, I can't move a lot because of the belt. But because the car is drifting sideways, especially on this last stretch here, the car is drifting sideways. My face is now outside of this wi window over here. Wind in a chapa. Lazima ni kwen character ju kamenje ko apa. Kuna moja mbili tatune. Na ingine hapa nyuma. Na so lazima ni scream. Na ni na scream. <laughs> Windi na ingia maze nili dry mpaka hapa. Nili sikia tu. Maze tuli stop hivi. Nili rija tu maji. Maji kwa hapi. But we were moving. Moving. Tuli simama maze. We stood there. When we just came to a stop, I looked at Ahmad. Ahmad looks at me. Even Ahmad himself. He said something. I won't say what he said. But ata ye. Ali amini. Ali amini. Ali. Hey! Yo. That was the best part. So there were many places we had to go um, in this section of Limuru tea plantation, showcasing just the. I mean, we are tea exporters. We make, we we manufacture tea, we process tea, we grow tea. So it's always great just to showcase this. For me, it was such a proud moment uh, for this to have happened. Then just wrapped the whole day because we had different scenes that we were taking, different places like this tight corner here. You can see like Ahmad Daham's precision. This was a one take, right? Uh, Ahmad Daham goes and Ahmad goes and views the location without the car. He goes and views it and knows where he'll be able to 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 drift well and what line to take. His precision is quite ninja precise. Like I understand why he's the world record holder. So to kenda home, to kalala, of course to mechoka next day peer production day re to amuke twenty. First location, October 20th. Akuna watuengi tao, or so we thought. Tuka ingi apale tao. Tao kuna scenes mbe. Jana uli lala ukaske uki drift. Jana. By the way, nili lala vizuri. Shida ni sasa uki ingi ya garitu normal. Shiro bana. Adama uzika. 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 <laughs> so Tulienda, the first place was of course the hawker's place and uh, where the matatu was. So of course we shoot inside, met incredible people from, from women to, 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 to young men to young ladies uh, who are there, guys who are you know actors in their own light and in their own right. And it was fantastic just to meet and act alongside all these guys and just to see them just for some of them it's their first time some of them they're probably doing this their hundredth time but it was fantastic just to do this and a lot of collaboration from all these guys without all these guys you couldn't have done it for real like salute to all the guys who came in and played a part played a role in the acting whether it's in the matatu in the hawking scene or even the acrobats themselves so the first place we do is of course this place for the hookers and it's one take um, we're all doing we're all trying our level best to do the one take so we do the hocus place for the banana buying the bananas ndizi nini kila kitu to the point where we're going into now traffic where Ahmad Daham is coming from when I go down on my knees and then Ahmad Daham comes um, so the best thing is here is where we reveal Ahmad Daham uh, for the very first time as he's kind of getting out of KICC right <laughs> story so sasa tunaenda ku shoot tunapata kuna kwaya ili kuna shoot video so governor governor ray johnson sakaja arthur aliweza maze ku lift ban ya ku shoot tao so of course kuna watu wana shoot on this public holiday kuna watu wana shoot gospel music video nani kwaya mzima hey now when I'm smart, so what can be what? This is gonna be funny. Hmm? This is gonna be funny. Oh, what does that mean? Because they don't know that the car does pop. It came so slowly. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
So, si tukaendelea na shuti yetu, ah juu igari venye igari. Ahmad Hama kaanza. Walisahau walikuwa na shoot music video yao. Eh? Bale gari imetoka watu wamesahau injili. Wakaenda kule mazee wengine wako na masimu nini 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 kila kitu. Hiyo kitu ilikuwa smart sana kuona venye watu hiyo gari tu. Leo injili ime ime imetolewa pembeni kidogo kwa sababu ya nini? Sababu ya gari. So anyway that was the first time we were introducing it was a fantastic shot. All the way to the point where he comes I have to stop him on the front. So of course at this time unajua I trust Ahmad. So there also some other actors like guys who are crossing kuna mmoja mazee fast take. Mzee aligwaya wewe leo na hiyo gari akona Hapa buda hey, gari ngori bro. Anyway tuliweza tu kufanya a few just three takes na tukaweza kupata. From there we went now to the place for the acrobats now that's where So both places we thought cause it's a public holiday hakuna wase mob. Hey pale mazee Hawkers already hapa Hilton watu wa Shaja. And of course kuna karaoke scene but karaoke pia wako jazzed. Wao wa mazee wao wao wa, wa, wa mazee hawako job. Wao wamekuja pia kuangalia gari wako pia mambisha. Unaona juu ya gari, hii gari ni nini? Eh hii gari iko na pao nyingine mwenda. Na huyu jamaa anafitaje huko ndani bwana. So anyway ile kwa fiti just to see guys taking and that's how people it ended up on TikTok. <laughs> Um, so it was good anyway free publicity for us for most of us so it was fantastic just to do the acrobat scene those are things that happen <laughs> Now we did the expressway. So expressway ilikuwa na technicality zake kidogo. So uh, just cause it's the expressway there are things we can't do on the ex main expressway like drifting we just did straights and then and we could only drift where we came to the end of the expressway at Westlands. So that's where we were able to drift. Uh, car going fully sideways for us to go on top of the bumps and also come through into the the ETC and just showcase the newly formed expressway that was fantastic for us to do <laughs> uh, and then from there we headed down and most people were saying hii ilikuwa ni side za ronga ama ilikuwa wapi side za kwenda ole polos no 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 Iliku... He he shot ilikuwa kimuka. <laughs> Barabara ya kimuka. It's not as busy, so it was fantastic for us to be able to shoot there. The heat was different. It was quite hot on that day, but the the precision again of Ahmad Daham's driving is crazy. This was a one take.
this right here was a one take at the very edge of this road and of course bringing in the dust and the smoke together so that was fantastic for us to do uh, did a lot of shots as well coming up the hill drifting up the hills um, and the bends did very well for us hey Daham. Hey, Daham. Oh, yeah. Ahmed Daham. <laughs> is he screaming? We need a record of him screaming. Two hours yesterday. Yeah? Slept two hours. Oh, oh my god, I'm so sorry. So I might sleep while driving. Yeah. I'll, I'll take over. <laughs> look, George, look. George has learned how to drift. That's hilarious. That's what he was doing last night. He didn't sleep either. And uh, most of all, Ngombe! Slow down, slow down, cows, cows, cows. Where's because I'm going to go to the house? I'm going to go So that was fantastic. And then we did also come to a place where we did uh, Gong Hills. Uh, Gong Hills was where the party scene was happening. Twenty minutes to four. We've done everything apart from one scene for today. And the scene is at 6. It's 20 minutes to 4. 2 hours, 20 minutes. Let's go. Let's go. Let's So fantastic doing this scene with Laura Kwamboi and uh, hey, she's she's talented like didn't need much it was cold like you guys are seeing her dress like this. it was freezing man like she's a champ the, most of them are champs everybody here who did not dress warmly was a champ for just withstanding that cold it was really cold and we did that whole last scene for the party scene and Ahmad Daham and I deliver Mimi in a package and I drive off dust killer kitu and finishing off with this shot of Ngong Hills. Nani ane zakataiki to man. So for me, this was such a blessing. Like, and thank you to Red Bull Kenya. Thank you to Red Bull head, head, headquarters, main office. Um, thank you for Ahmad Daham for letting this chubby, chunky, yummy looking kind of guy to be in your car. Um, thank you to all the production guys. Um, to Kev, Kevin Ridriani. Youngster, like this guy is founder of Drone Nectar Limited and co-founder of Aerial Eye Africa as well. Uh, man, guys, like there are young guys doing fantastic things in this country, in this production world. Uh, use of FPV drones. They're assembling their own FPV drones. His story is amazing. I captured his story. I'll edit this video and put it up just for anybody who wants to be inspired uh, to do just the passions that they have. So it was fantastic just to meet all these guys from sound, um, from the sound crew as well. Um, it was fantastic. My many thanks definitely go to Ruby um, just for steering this whole thing for me and for us uh, together with my manager Karemi Kagwe. And it was fantastic for us to be just in, be in this production. Most of all, thanks to God. I didn't know anyone. I didn't know who to call. I didn't have connections. I didn't hear the auditions. Uh, backstory is I just hear my name was floated in a boardroom together with someone else's um, a focus group was called and the focus group chose me and the boss who's international was like fine we'll go with this guy like all I want to tell you is keep doing what you're doing you don't need to be as famous as some someone else and uh, do your time keep doing your time it will may take longer than anybody else it may take longer than the other person but keep doing your time keep doing it and be diligent with your craft Keep doing that stuff that you think people are not interested in. Uh, keep and keep embellishing, keep improving, keep edifying your craft, keep learning. There's someone always watching. Whether there are two views or two million views, there's someone always watching who will just be like, I want that and I need that and I have to have that. And they'll do anything and everything to be able to get your contacts and call you. That's the main bottom line for this thing. So from me to you is keep doing you, keep doing your craft, keep doing your passion. For me, this is the best thing that ever happened to me in 2022. Tomorrow, coming soon. <laughs>